I am a registered unaffiliated voter and the reason why that is is because Colorado is known as a purple state which means we're neither blue or neither red we're pretty purple and I think that that has a lot of power in the elections because it means that both parties have to come here and they have to vie for our vote. The reason why I'm planning on voting in this midterm election and the presidential elections and every election thereafter is because I'm tired of hearing the same narrative in the news that Latinos don't vote and Latinos are this big sleeping giant. That narrative has to stop because the reason that narrative exists is because we're not turning out, we're not demanding the political rights that we deserve. Immigration is 100% a factor in um, getting my vote because what people have to understand about immigration is that it's not just political, it's personal, especially for Latino voters. My motivation to get out and vote is um, I don't want to see someone that's anti-immigrant, anti-my community in a Senate seat where he represents the entire people of Colorado. We're real people with everyday struggles and we're just trying to keep our families together and we're just trying to get by and give ourselves and our children a better life than we could have ever imagined being back in our home countries. And it's not fair to use our lives as a political gain or as a pawn to use for any sort of winning of seats. And it's just, it's not fair and it's not right. Yeah, immigration does play a key, key role in my family when it comes to politics. Um, my parents having an undocumented son and, his bro and my brother's having an undocumented brother makes it their, one, their number one priority when it comes to a candidate. If a candidate does not agree or share the same values that my family shares, um, it is definitely a candidate that will not get our family support. O votas por un demócrata que ha desilusionado y no ha hecho, no ha tomado las acciones debidas que el pueblo, el que el pueblo le ha pedido, o votan por un republicano que va a ser, puede hacer más daño que ayudar. Entonces, este, ponen contra la espada y la pared. I think the motivation is, you know, getting home after school and hoping that my dad's going to keep walking through that door every day um, after a long day of work. Um, I think I always think about my parents when it comes to the work I do and all the other community um, that's affected by the same issue, that's affected by our politicians not taking the step forward to be able to do what's right. Well, you get all, um, votar por la gente que crea lo que yo creo. Así que no es un partido específico. Um, creo que importa mucho las decisiones que ellos tomen y pues estamos viendo las decisiones que ellos están tomando desde aquí. Y nosotros vamos a recordar quiénes fueron nuestros aliados en la lucha por nuestras familias. Y por lo menos yo voy a recordar cuando pueda votar um, el año que entra. Va a ser algo que yo voy a poder recordar y voy a tener a mi familia en mente cada vez que abra mi boleto.